First off, before we get into the video, let me explain what an iceberg, media iceberg is. It's a little tier of it, tier list of information from most common to most unknown. Alright, let's get into the video. Julius the Cat. Julius the Cat was Walt Disney's first cartoon star, even before Oswald, which is mistakenly known as the first and it was clearly Julius the Cat, as he was created in 1922, many years before Oswald's debut would occur. Pete the Bear. Pete the Bear was uh, Pete's character in the Alice comedies. There's not much else to say. The Alice comedies. The Alice comedies was Walt Disney's second series, right after, uh, right after the Laughograms. It's a series that that, that com combines live action and cartoon, even before Who Framed Roger Rabbit and even Space Jam. Doll character from Alice Comedies. If this is referring to the doll character in the Alice Comedies, the first, first cartoon, like the first cartoon friend of Alice, even before Julius became the main the main side character, Alice, and that's. All. And now we're going to the depths. Julius, Julius the Cat is Trevor Henderson's cartoon cat theory. This is a theory that Trevor Henderson's cartoon cat is actually Julius the Cat. And I kind of do agree with this theory as they are both forgotten cartoon stars. What makes sense as, as, as Julius the as you know, Julius the Cat has lost all it. And if that was comedies. I would, I would say he probably lost all his friends, or if the friends he did have. If this is correct, that means that even Cartoon Dog would have been that one dog when he was comedies. I wanted to say, and I would say the reason why he turned to Cartoon Cat is probably because he went insane after the end of the Dallas Comedy Series. And the cause of his insanity was about half of his friends leaving him. And that's why I think this theory could be possibly true. Julius the Cat is the strongest Disney character theory. This is a this is my own theory I made up that Julius the Cat is the strongest Disney character, and I and I would and and my canon yes I think he could beat every character even even the characters from those those movies based on classic stories and fairy tale fairy tales. And next we're going on to the Mickey Mouse Elevator Roblox Iceberg, the OG Mickey Mouse Elevator. The OG or original Mickey Mouse Elevator was the first Mickey Mouse Elevator created by a uh, created by a Roblox player known as iPlay underscore all game. iPlay underscore all game, the creator of the first Mickey Mouse Elevator game, and and it was mo it was the most popular back in the later twenty back at the end of twenty twenty to early twenty twenty one. Actually, started to decrease in popularity as uh, as you know, by near the the start of 2023, as at that point, as that as that point, the the elevator genre from Mickey Mouse, the character himself, started to become very non-popular. Chev, Chev is the creator. Chev or Chev U O R is the creator of the second Mickey Mouse elevator, which is the one that has one of the most famous floors from the from Mickey Mouse Elevator games. Those, like, like the Oswald's Clubhouse floor. The Mickey Mouse Study XC floor, and even the Disney White Noise floor. Gamer Hexapod. Gamer Hexapod was the was was a, is a YouTuber who does who did videos on the Mickey Mouse Elevator, and it was the main one who popularized the genre, as people as many people watched it, and a lot and people just like me are the reason why the reason why you have nostalgia attached to it. I play underscore all games or lobby. The, it, this is basically talking about the old lobby of the Mickey Mouse Elevator by iPlayer Game, the original. This this lobby, I would have to say, is a lot unique, more unique than the original in Season 1, and the remastered version of the original lobby in se Seasons 5 through 6, at the, at the end of Season 5, for, to the start and end of Season 6. The, uh, the, a bit, the, uh, the, uh, tip. The OG Mickey Mouse Elevator has been privated. Talked about how the original Mickey Mouse Elevator game created by a player game has been privated, and caused it to be unplayable, and it has made the game become lost media. 
Thank you, Mouse Elevator, Lost Media. This this is talking about Lost Media release in the Mouse Elevator that will not be found until people should take action on it. And this, in this video, I, I, I'm mainly pointing this video towards getting people to do this. If you love this genre and you're nostalgic with it as I am and you really want to do something about finding Lost Media towards it, you want to support me, go, go, go to my Lost Media page. Lost Media. Um, go to my, uh, and an archive page known as the Mickey Mouse Elevator Roblox Archive. Original Mickey Mouse Elevator footage still on YouTube. It's talking about how there's footage of 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 the of both both I play all games old version and Chevy OR's old version still on YouTube. And you're actually able you can actually go on YouTube now and use it for free. So I would I would advise to check that out. I play all game republished the OG Mickey Mouse Elevator on his old account on his alt alt alternate account in 2024. He's talking about how on I play all games alt account known as Cristiano Ronaldo based off the name of the famous Brazilian soccer player published the original Mickey Mouse Elevator from 2021 onto Roblox again. And this has happened as of recent. For line 95. Roland 95 is the person who released the old lobby of iPlay on the Scroll Games as a mod. Mickey Mouse Elevator hacking instance. This is relating to the incidents of hacking related to Shebs and iPlay on the Scroll Games remakes of the Mickey Mouse Elevator.